overuse of antibiotics has made Europe's hospitals danger zones for patients. The European Parliament was quick to realize that antimicrobial resistance posed a serious and persistent threat, and the European Commission reported that within 30 years, antimicrobial resistance could kill more Europeans than cancer. To fight back against this deadly risk, Italian researchers have developed PCHS, a hospital hygiene system which could revolutionize our healthcare. I spoke with centre-right MEP and former Slovenian Prime Minister Alios Pertile about why action is needed now. It's exponentially worsening, uh, so action is needed. There is a growing attention and I think we were very clear uh, in our attitude to deal uh, more efficiently with IMR. There are solutions, there are approaches which are underestimated or simply not considered well. I asked the Italian research team why AMR was such a threat and burden to modern society and what the key findings of the research actually mean for European healthcare. Infection uh, are connected with the cost, you need the further, but also suffering from patients. That means it's not just a cost, it's just suffering, complication, a longer stay in the hospital and more, more diagnostics, more uh, drugs. We started last year with this uh, study it was a multi-center study uh, involving seven hospitals and five different universities in Italy. And this study was uh, mainly based uh, on the results we got uh, in the seven years before, showing that uh, with uh, a sanitation system based on a biological principle, uh, we could modify and modulate the microbiota inside the hospital environments. The key uh, findings uh, was that uh, we were able, by modifying microbiota, to modulate also the antimicrobial resistance of the microbes persistent in the persistent contamination of hospitals, and this means that we can also decrease an impact on the incidence of hospital infections, and this was the main goal of this work. For the citizens, if well adopted and implemented, this research is totally in line with the expectations of citizens and patients' perspective, talking about the, the patient right to safety, innovation and so on. The next step is to promote alliance and partnership in order to increase consciousness about the phenomenon. That is uh, discussing or testing the effectiveness of using uh, microbes, uh, if the good microbes, in the environment to try to reduce uh, transmission of infection related to healthcare. That is a very important news and uh, give us a very important hints about the, this opportunity. We worked uh, mainly on on the internal medicine wars for this study. In the internal medicine wars, what we observed, it was, it was a 52% less incidence of HAI as compared to the chemical-based sanitation. And this is very important. When they were exposed to this cleaning system, uh, so we had a pre-post study in the post half of patient uh, didn't get an infection. So one in two was not uh, was avoided an infection with the PCHS uh, by the mechanism of a competition of antagonism competitive antagonism the probiotic containing contained in this uh, system are able to colonize the surfaces uh, and to prevent recontamination so you get a very stable abatement of pathogens è un sistema però in cui tutte le sue fasi di applicazione sono controllate e monitorate e registrate. Questo è molto importante perché con il sistema PCHS di fatto noi si garantisce un risultato. Possiamo verificare su campo che le infezioni in effetti vengono ridotte e soprattutto i costi vengono ridotti di quasi l'80%. Our commitment, public and private bodies, civic society as well, have to increase the consciousness about this, this phenomenon. Con questa ricerca denominata Sanica abbiamo richiamato sicuramente l'attenzione della classe non solo politica, certamente politica delle autorità sanitarie perché i risultati dimostrano che l'ambiente incide in maniera rilevante su quella che è la filiera della salute e potendo portare su questo dei risultati impressionanti 
eh, tali che non possono non essere presi seriamente in considerazione, il eh, 52% di riduzione delle infezioni, il 61% di riduzione del consumo degli antibiotici. What's clear from this peer-reviewed Italian study is that PCHS offers a real and serious alternative to traditional hospital hygiene. The question now is whether Europe continues to fight a losing battle against AMR using traditional hygiene methods or whether Europe acts quickly, saving lives and protecting budgets.